For me, jazz is just that the fact that you're channeling how you're feeling and channeling your thoughts honestly into the music rather than just what's on the page and that it can be different every time you listen to it, every time you perform it. And I think because you're improvising, you're able to have a conversation not only with the people in the band, but with the audience. One thing I love about jazz, if you're happy, it comes through in your playing and the audience can feel that and they sort of respond to it. If you're angry as well, they can feel that and they feel the energy. So for me, jazz is about the community and the communication and the togetherness and the idea of telling a story and creating something together. I do think that there still needs to be a bit more work in presenting female jazz musicians. Um, there are a lot more of us that's presented than what is presented in the media at the moment. I really encourage my female students to perform and be in front of an audience. I try to show examples of listening as well, so play music from people that, um, female musicians that they might like, or I'm starting to get them to compose their own tunes as well, so I'm gonna start bringing in female composers as well as everyone else like Bach that people already know about. In regards to misogyny and um, sexism, um, there's been subtle things. But generally, no, I'm from a really supportive community where um, men and women are treated as equals. Obviously, there's a still some kind of hier hierarchy which um, I think exists because women are always judged by how they look first. So I feel if you fit a certain aesthetic or you're conventionally attractive, then you do generally get a bit more attention. Um, but otherwise, I think I'm from a really supportive group of people.